you've heard me speak recently or read some of my articles, you will know that I'm very passionate about leaders who are demanding a return to the office on the premise that if you don't go back to the office, it will destroy the culture. That's absolute BS. Culture does not live in a building, in an office or in a location. Culture is a shared set of values, beliefs, expectations. And it was pleasing to read an article in Harvard Business Review that supported that stance and referenced a Gartner survey. And that Gartner survey said that only 25% of remote knowledge workers feel connected to their culture. That's one in four, only one in four feel connected to the culture. And I'll put it that there wasn't a good culture to start with, that the culture was already broken before people went to work remotely. And Alexia Cambon, who's an executive, sorry, a research director in Gartner's HR practice, summed it up and I'll quote. She said, I find it ironic when leaders say they need to bring workers back to the office because of culture. They're going to get the opposite of what they hoped for. Instead of viewing hybrid work, I would say remote work, as a, dis as a disruption to the cultural experience, Leaders should see it as an opportunity to build culture differently. And I absolutely agree. This is a great opportunity to reshape culture and also equip leaders to lead remote teams effectively. And the Gartner article is called Evolve Culture and Leadership for a Hybrid World. And it says there's three things that we need to do. Firstly, and this is foundational, firstly, understand that remote work is not a threat to workplace culture or leadership success. It's an opportunity to strengthen them. And once you've got your head around that, then you can intentionally reinforce greater and more impactful ways for people to connect with your culture. And then the third is ensuring leaders are equipped and they can take a more human approach to leading people. And that's about being authentic, empathetic and adaptive. So this week I'm going to talk about the second of those things, how we need to evolve the culture. <laughs>